Right, well, guys, con congratulations. If you could use a word or a couple words to describe this one, how, how, what would you use? Um, R5 victory. Um, it was definitely against a, a well-coached uh, team. They, they, were, they were very tough. Um, I think we just stayed together, stayed to the game plan, and as a team, we just fought through and played through. So just proud of these guys and just very happy with this win. But uh, we do have a lot that we can learn from, even in victory. So we'll come back and just learn from it. And it was about you know trying to get back that defensive edge and look they they can hit shots and then did all of a sudden after a while did it just come just just kind of like a shootout so to speak and match and shot for shot or how do you um, kind of approach that? I mean we don't really see it like that you know we like the coaches and us we just really focus on the defense and what we can do from you know stopping them from making all those shots you know so like uh, we, we had a lot of mess ups and uh, over time you know including myself in the uh, late late re regulation that we, that we could uh, you know improved on you know it will be better. Oh, I know. Coach has talked about you playing more aggressively offensively. Is that what happened tonight or just what was working for you? Um, definitely. It, it was just my mindset going in. I know that these guys always tell me to go with attack and be aggressive. So I, I know they don't mind me attacking, trying to take those shots. And then they were just finding me in great positions. So and uh, it helps to have a hot night like this. But uh, these guys were just uh, driving, uh, getting two on the ball, and just hitting me in my spot. So thank you for that. How's your hand feeling? Look like you hurt it. Oh, it's just a little jam. You know, I'll be OK. But uh, so I was just dealing with that. But. Overall, I'll be fine. I know after you did that, it looked like you bricked one three, and then later you made one. Did I guess did it hurt when to shoot at the end? Uh, a little bit, bit, but you know, you just gotta have that that mindset of uh, what's more important. Uh, do I want to complain about my finger, or do I want to say, hey, I won, and my finger hurts? But uh, I just shot it, and I was just kind of like, that's why I just looked up. I was like, thank you, God, because <laughs> it took a lot to shoot that one. Did, did you feel like you had a little bit of a mismatch with their lineup and what they were doing defensively? Um, a little bit. Yeah, uh, yeah you know, coach always <laughs> 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 coach just always says, you know, uh, if I if I do have a big on me, just to be more assertive, uh, attack and drive. And if I do get the two on me to uh, spray it out to the guys, I was also able to get five assists, which I was proud about. You know, just hitting these guys again in their in their spots and then returning the love. Was there a point, Justin, where you guys needed to be more aggressive and stop selling for threes? Did coach, did the coaching staff ever mention that? Just go out uh, of the bucket a little more? Uh, no, I mean, no. He, he really doesn't say the type of shots that we should shoot, you know, because, like, I mean, it, it could be open uh, three-point three shot. You know, he always wants to take us uh, the open and unbalanced ones. Uh, you know, the main thing he says is when we're driving, go in there strong, go in there out two, and, and go in there looking for contact, you know. Um, me, myself included, you know, I, I have to do a better job of finishing the rack. You know, I, I will be better. And, so first half, you guys got up by 10, and then there was like six minutes there where you didn't score. How did you guys kind of have to readjust after they went on that run? We had to stop starting. We weren't playing defense. I mean, we're going to have spurts where we don't score, but uh, what separates us from winning and losing is our defense. Um, so whenever we have those droughts, it's still a two-point game, three-point game. You know, and then when we cut it back on, that's when we can get it up to 10, 15. You know, so we got to be better at that. What do you think it means, too? I mean, this was a game of momentum and runs. and. You know, you look like you guys had it, and they had it. But to, to come out on top in a game like this, I think Al said, there's things to learn from. But how much is this going to mean to this team moving forward? You think? Yeah, like Al was saying, uh, we just like grind it out. It's a good uh, win for us to grind it out in the long haul. Uh, like you said, there was ups and downs. Um, but I think uh, it's good for us to have one like this early in the season to to know what it takes to win down the stretch um, and and uh, really do what it takes. Like I said, to to get it done when when it really counts at the end. I know you guys were down, obviously, after the Denver game. It seemed like today was just kind of a fun game overall. Was this a nice one to have to kind of get that taste out of your mouth? Yeah, for sure. And, you know, it, it, it was nice, you know, coming to the home, home fans, you know, have them being loud and giving us energy. Yeah, fans were great. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah, and our mindset coming to this game was, you know, we're, we're coming to dominate, we're coming to defend, we're, and we're coming in the way. That's what we did. It's also fun. I mean, you know, high-scoring game. And um, don't get me wrong, you'll, I'm sure you'll take the win, even if it's 20 to 13 or whatever. But, you know, up and down. Was this just a fun game to be yeah, in? Yeah, for sure. These are the games we like to play, you know, where it's where it's, it's the players play. You know, it, coach always wants the tempo to be up and down. Uh, you know, we, we use the altitude at our advantage. You know, the, the players were talking about how the, the, our, our altitude is real strong. <laughs> so that was funny. Um, yeah, but, you know, we continue to take advantage of that, continue to play our game. You know, but Cowboy basketball will be good. Free throws being focused maybe this week? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, it was just a, it was a bad night. We're, you and 35 have a little beef there going on? Oh, no, you know, uh, he, he actually caught me, so we were just having a little, a little talk back and forth, so I had to go back at him, but it's, it's all fun, you know. I told him at the end of the game, you know, he told me, great job, way to hoop, told him the same thing, and he's a tough dude, so uh, it's just all for the love of the game.
you know, having a big game now against the Final Four team, how do you guys kind of take this momentum and keep it? Uh, we're going in and win. Now, uh, was it the block that you hurt your hand on or re hurt it? Uh, I or do you remember what it <laughs> <laughs> I think it was. I think it was the uh, first time he tried to dunk it. I think I went up to try to block it and just kind of smacked my finger on the rim or something. Mm -hmm. But I'm good. <laughs> All right.